What's up, my G bros? Hope everyone's doing well today. All right, so what I wanna show you today is how you can remove the 12 volt cigarette lighter up on your front dash. Um, here, so you have this here. Yours might look different. Sometimes they're just black or regular, or sometimes this one will have a cover or no covers, but I have this all apart and I wanna show you exactly how it comes out so that way you don't damage yours which is very possible if you don't know what you're doing so hang tight let me get this camera set up and we'll show you how it's done so first things first this assembly is extremely easy to take out there's no bolts or screws involved all you need is a pry tool and then you have one two three four clips that clip in and you just take this sucker right here and pry it out easy peasy okay so the setup for the 12 volt goes just as so you have this here you have your ring which you know we can call it the trim ring so you see that little notch that notch goes and oops that notch right there that notch goes in like that so like that there so that's going to be in there but this comes out separate as you can see so <clears throat> when this is in here, I'm going to go ahead and lightly set it in. I'm not going to put it in so it's stuck. But so you see these holes here? One and two. So these little pieces here, see that? That piece and that piece are going to be basically locked in there so what you got to do is you got to take a screwdriver and while it's in there you got to basically pry it up in a way to where you're not holding this down so like if you were trying to do this this wouldn't be right because you'd be prying but you'd also be pushing down so it's going to take a little bit of work, but what you can do is you can get a pick or something like this. And, you know, you're basically going to kind of have to chip away at it a little bit. But if you can get two and kind of work it, you press one in there like that and push it up. And then you also have these little holes here to help. So if you have two hands or you know another person that can help you basically pry on these here at the same time you can get two of these and then this will come out first and then when you have this out if you want to take this out all you have to do is press these suckers right there those will be locked in let me see if I can show you Oh yeah, right there. So once this is out, once the actual 12 volt cigarette lighter is out, then this trim ring will come out. But if you were to look at this, you'd say, oh, maybe you just have to push those to get the whole assembly out. Well, no, that's not how it goes. This first and then the trim ring. So, you know, it's it took me a little bit. One thing I did was I took some electronic cleaner and I kind of sprayed in there and I, my purpose was to use it as sort of a lube, you know, because I know it's not going to damage anything and if anything, it's going to help clean it. This still works, but what I'm actually going to do is my stereo has a, um, you know, like a USB plug that comes from the back. So I'm actually going to put my USB plug in here so that way it can look better and I don't have a random USB plug hanging out. I only really use this one for my phone charger. So, you know, it kind of works out well. So yeah, there's that. Let me just show you another look here. 
these prongs, you know, those don't really have anything to do with getting it out. It's just the tabs in these holes. And once again, you can take picks. I have a couple here. So something like this would honestly be ideal. You know, two of these. And you just kind of work it up, work it up, work it up, work it up. And then eventually it'll come up far enough. And then once it comes up, you know, just a tiny bit, you'll be able to pry that sucker out and mission is complete. Anyways, guys, I really hope that this video helped you out in some way please subscribe to my channel the jeep 4.0 bro and my other channel is motorcyclists i'll link it down below but hey guys i really appreciate you have a good one peace